Yes, it was an awful result. Um, I mean, actually, we had a rather similar result in a by-election in Rotherham a few months ago, and it was shortly afterwards followed by our victory at Eastleigh. So, uh, I mean, the results have been very varied. I mean, where we don't, we haven't campaigned, and that was a good example yesterday night, we, we, we do badly. But where we have a very good record on the ground and campaign hard, which is what we did at Eastleigh, we, we're rewarded. Well, there are net losses. I don't think we've lost as many as the Conservatives. And where we've been up against the Conservatives, we've tended to do relatively well and we've gained seats, particularly in those areas where we've had sitting MPs. But yeah, it is a difficult night. And we're learning painfully that when you're in government and people get angry and want to protest, they take it out on the governing parties, including us. They are a protest party, and in the past we've benefited from that. So I think we need to treat their voters with respect. We're talking about a quarter of the electorate who've chosen to protest in this way. Uh, I think when we an analyse it, I mean, you actually don't have any practical solutions to the issues around the economy or our future in Europe. It, it is an emotional reaction, but nonetheless has to be treated seriously, has to be treated with respect, and we've got to debate with them. I'm not worried about the general election. I mean, it will be a very different kind of election, fought on very different principles in, I think, the eight parliamentary constituencies where we were uh, up against Conservatives in the south of England. We increased our share in, in five of them. Uh, I think when it comes to the general election, people will be very conscious that we are part of a coalition dealing with a massive economic crisis, uh, providing stability. We've taken on responsibility. Now, it's unpopular in the short run, and we, we acknowledge that, but I don't think this has any implication for the general election at all. Well, it's a choice we made when we went into government. Um, and we went into coalition because that was the outcome of the last election, demanded that we work together with another party and that we worked together on the national interest on a major economic crisis. And we knew when we did it, it was in the short run, it was going to cost us popularity, and it certainly has. Uh, but I think at the end of this parliament, when people reflect, they will realise that we've actually done something positive and important, and that we ret retain a very distinctive party with our own agenda. We had a lot of achievements in government in terms of what we've done, in terms of uh, lifting the tax uh, burden on, on low earners, in terms of the state pension, and the kind of work I'm doing in industrial strategy. And I think that will count in our favour.